This is our trailer we cook contests in and we sleep in and all that good stuff. Um, let me get over here a little further. There we go. I'm trying to keep the license plate out of view for obvious reasons. But um, nothing too extraordinary about the outside. I'll hop over here and show you our power inlet. This is a regular old power inlet that we plug an extension cord into and that gives 120 volts uh, throughout the whole trailer or um, power from the contest. Uh, normally they have a big generator running or we'll run our um, normal generator, little generator, which you'll probably see that in the trailer. So, But that's it. That's the outside. Let's go inside. Let me hop up here without getting killed. Ah. Some of you don't know, I broke my leg this summer, so uh, it's been kind of crazy. But uh, this is the trailer. Here, I'll do a, a slow... <laughs> it's not a very wide angled lens on this thing. It's just my phone, so. But, um, place to keep aprons, all right. Uh, fly swatters, I'll just kind of start in one area and go right around and give you a tour. Um, this is a place for, um, when we get there, we got a lot more stuff hanging from that. Uh, we do um, um, we do an umbrella from right there. Um, and we also, of course, have a broom and dustpan, all that good stuff. Um, you gotta have a Michigan flag in the joint for sure. Um, good clock, that's an atomic clock. Um, man, that thing lets me know what temperature it is and in here, all that good stuff. Uh, this is kind of a wash area, if you will place to hang towels and all that good stuff uh, of course we keep towels in there hand sanitizer normally our spritzing bottle rides right here I don't know where it's at but uh, we're in here cleaning up and stuff so I kind of figured it'd be cool to give you guys a tour um, these are empty uh, we don't do a whole lot of totes anymore um, because we have the trailer so um, these, yeah I'm, I'm really not trying to do shameless plugs here I just <laughs> I got stickers hanging out so anyways um yeah this is our drawer we keep it all tied up when we're rolling with this so that's right there and we'll take that down there to that hook anyways let me show you what's in here so some utensils etc everything rides right there of course um this is oh yeah candy Nailed it. It's a bonus there. Gloves. Okay. We use these for all kinds of stuff. Of course, the dirty ones we use for grates and etc. And of course, you got to have some welding gloves uh, for handling hot stuff. Anyways, it's uh, more of kitchen utensils and stuff like that in this drawer system versus that big one over there. Um, then we got some coolers. Oh, you know what? Before I get too crazy. There's a kiddo coming in. Um, we, this is our cooler that kind of just rides with it. Of course, we got rugs and stuff back here. When we get to a contest and get set up, we got rugs on the floor. Uh, makes it a little more homey, I guess, homely, whatever. And um, it actually um, kind of a little better on your feet, I guess, if you will. Because uh, it can be cold, and then if you're in here with just socks on or something like that, trying to get comfy for the night. Um, oh, yeah, there's the playbook. Nice. That's the playbook. Anyways, um, we keep coffee in our coffee maker and stuff like that in here because um, the cooler seals up a little better. So it kind of keeps the coffee fresh, etc. Um, so I guess let's move. That's a six foot stainless steel table. Let's see if I can get it better. There you go. Six foot stainless steel table. Um, of course, that's what we do all our prep and everything on turn-ins, all that good stuff. I wanna say it's 30 inches, it's 30 inches deep. Yeah, 30 inches deep and six feet long. So that's what the scoop is with that thing. Um, right there is where the power comes in. Like I was telling you before, we got the outlet, or I'm sorry, inlet out there. So it comes in there, goes up here to this receptacle. I installed all this stuff a little while back. 
Um, goes to that receptacle so we can charge phones and make our coffee, all that good stuff. Of course, anything you need electrical for. And then uh, you see it goes up there. There's a piece right here that I didn't want to drill into. So I just came out. Uh, we're going to be redoing the trailer. That's why I'm doing this video. So you can kind of, excuse me, you can see uh, what it looks like now and uh, what it'll look like when I'm done with it. So, um, of course, paper towel, gloves, got to have gloves. Um, magnet strip for when we're uh, doing turn-ins and we're shucking and jiving in here we uh, keep our knives right there that way we can have them at our disposal um, you gotta have utensils for the dry erase board over here <laughs> <laughs> so yeah oh yeah she wrote that she writes on it she lets us know all about how she wants us to win isn't that right Okay, so this is like a trough, I guess, if you will. But anyways, um, this is like three feet long. So that way we can keep all of our rubs, sauces, everything we need. We get to a contest, we throw everything right in there. Here, I'll show you. I don't know. There you go, see? Fits right in there, beautiful thing. It's all good. We normally don't keep rubs and stuff in here. Like I told you, we're, uh, we're in here kind of cleaning out, messing around, so. I figured I'd show you a little little tour. Um, we keep sponsored banners in there. That's where they ride. This is ours, I think. Let's see. Might be kind of cool to show you. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, hold that in. Kenzie May. This is eight feet long, so you won't be able to see all of it, but there's most of it. it says, oh yeah, right there. Anyways. So that's our banner, that's where that one rides. And there's a couple in others in there. Um, but anyways, yeah, so there you go, Tom. There you go, buddy. I haven't taken them off, just for you. Uh, Tom's the one that's in the trailer, so that's his, that's his uh, team right there. Shout out to Tom, Matt, and Keith, all them guys. Um, this is a catch-all. Uh, we got lights in there. We got all kinds of crap in there. Um, this is these are thermometers, stuff like that. Of course, drill. I mean, you can see all that stuff. Paper towel, I believe. Yeah. Um, well, that's a turn-in bag for when it's kind of colder out. You can keep your turn-ins warm. Um, these are mattresses down here. They just ride in that thing. Uh, Cambro normally sits up there when we're at a contest. That way we can walk right over here. You know, we're only taking a few steps, grab our food out, come right here, and um, and uh, start building the box, whatever we got going on. Or I guess we can come in here, check our ribs, whatever, and then throw it in the Cambro, Cambro, etc. That is our. What are you laughing at? Yeah. That's our um, beverage cooler, stuff like that. Uh, that's what we use for that. We kind of use that as our snacks and whatever else is going on. We actually keep ice and stuff in that one. This one stays dry like I was telling you. Jerry can for water. You gotta have a jerry can for water. Um, so this over here is kind of our station for tying things down, if you will. Um, of course we've got a heater. This thing right here, believe it or not, as small as it as small as it is, of course, you know, our trailer is seven by fourteen, seven foot by fourteen feet, so it's not huge, but um, this thing right here on low will sweat you out of here. So, I mean, it's awesome. Of course, we insulated the trailer, etc. But um, that's our weight. That's uh, weights for our tent. These right here are blocks for our jacks. We have four jacks that um, jack the trailer up and so it's not weebly wobbly. That's a technical term there. We do that one. Um, so, we got a charcoal chimney. That's a gas can for the generator. Generator's not in here, but. Uh, those are all straps. Of course, that's a vacuum. <laughs> I guess I'm just showing you everything now. Uh, chairs. Of course, we can keep them strapped down. See what I was telling you. Um, 10 by 10 tent. Got to have a fire extinguisher. This is a tote for... <laughs> that's a tote, in case you're wondering. But that's a tote for uh, wood and stuff like that for our stick burner. So when we are throwing sticks, so to speak, that's where we keep our sticks. Let me get over here. Um, that's where we tie down our table, tables, and this is a, it's kind of our chemical station, I guess, if you will. We keep it over here, far away from the table, 
in that way. Um, obviously, it's staying away from the food and all that good stuff. So uh, we just keep wipes right there. Of course, you can see all this stuff. Like this is stainless steel cleaner. This is bleach cleaner, um, like all surface cleaner or something, an SD greaser. And uh, yeah, that all rides right there. And um, of course, D-rings down here. Yeah, let me get back over here. And I'll show you. So, um, when the smoker's in here, watch out, baby. There you go. That's okay. Right there. So you see the D-rings. You see four D-rings. Uh, we'll load the cooker in here, which is like seven feet long. We'll load the cooker in here and uh, tie it down. So, I mean, those are the tie-downs for the, for the cooker. And um, like I was telling you about the rugs, we'll take the rugs and we'll, I'll put them right here in front of the table. Hopefully I'm not making you sick by all this swirling around, but um, we'll lay them right here in front of the table. And that kind of gives us like a runway to walk and it covers up some of the D-rings. So uh, they are a flush mount, but still it's kind of a, you know, kind of something else to make it a little homey in here when you're, when you're staying in here. So try to make it as comfortable as possible. <laughs> what you doing? I'm trying to write that kind of public barbecue. Oh, the block letters? Yeah. Keep working at it. Oh, well, I might as well explain the dry erase board. I don't think I have yet. Um, so the dry erase board keeps our timeline and everything up there. Um, these are... Let me think of them. Well, I mean, they're uh, the colors for the... Um, bleh, they are the colors for our thermometers. So um, what this means, so the numbers are for the thermometer itself and these are for the probes. So these are the um, colors of the probes. Anyways, that's a whole other video, right? So um, so yeah, we keep a dry erase board in here because it's nice and handy. We can, I mean, we can literally check off stuff as we're going, it, it works out great. So, um, Man, I think that's about it. I mean, besides, you know, vents. So we have a regular old vent there. And then, uh, of course, we got flush um, pod lights, I guess you can call them. Pot lights, can lights. Um, this is a light for, not a light, it's a light. This is a vent for when it's raining. So as you can see, it's got like a cover on it. So uh, we can still have this open and vent out some air when it's raining out and rain doesn't get in here. So, like I said before, we are going to be redoing this. Um, we do like the way it's set up, but we want to insulate the sides. The top's insulated, and it does a great job. You can see there where we've insulated some. But uh, we're going to do it all in one-inch foam board. Uh, we are going to put half-inch, eh, three-eighths or half-inch board on the sides. That way we can drill everything right into it. We don't have to have these supports. Because this is, uh, for those of you that don't know, these trailers have real thin walls. It's actually called Luan, so it's kind of plywood, but it's real thin. Um, and then what you got to do is you got to span, you know, I, this is what I did anyways. But I took uh, self-tapping screws, screwed right into the beam. Or not the beam, you know, the support, metal support. On each side of it, I spanned two of them. That way I can put some, just put something with some weight on it, you know what I mean? Instead of going into this thin... Um, plywood, like I was telling you. So anyways, um, yeah, tables go right there. Man, I think that's about it. So, uh, yeah, that's the, that's the trailer. I've seen some trailer tours on uh, YouTube, but nobody ever really goes into detail. They just kind of walk in the trailer and go, yeah, so this is it. Um, <laughs> I thought maybe I'd give you a little insight on how it operates, you know? Maybe you can kind of imagine us in here going crazy, trying to win a contest. But anyways, uh, that's it. So, um, you want to say anything? Bye. Yeah, bye.